Hi everybody and welcome to another episode of Project Zomboid. Last episode we left it where I'd uh, just been to the uh, that place over there and gathered some loot up. Got an axe, I got um, a saw, I got a few other things as well, basically enough to start chopping down trees and fortifying the house. Now when I ended the episode um, I said that I was going to organise all of the cabinets and everything ready for this episode. I haven't done that, not really anyway. Um, Yeah, I haven't done that at all. Basically, because I'm going to build some uh, shelves. You can make shelves as part of carpentry. So um, I'm going to make some shelves which will give me extra storage space so that I can then organise them. So at the end of this episode, I will organise stuff. This episode is going to be mainly focused on um, fortifying the house and getting some... Um, Get it, yeah, basically getting the, uh, the house fortified and getting some wood and some storage. So without further ado, let's do it. Right, so we'll unpack the axe. We'll unpack the saw. We'll hit number four. Twice. That'll put the axe in now, I think. Now what you can, what you can do is you can, you can manually chop a tree like, like that if you line up properly. Uh, <laughs> You can, I swear you can. There you go. Two, three, four, five. It doesn't take much to chop down a tree. Always keep checking behind you because zombies can sneak up. If you right click the logs, you can saw the logs. Saw both of them. You get three planks per log. Yeah, you do. You get three planks per log. Right, that'll sort the logs uh, one at a time. So you get six planks. Now, if you have a hammer then you can hammer in the morning and the evening and all over this land. Yeah, you get that. Uh, Christians will get that. Um, right, so if you have a hammer, then you can um, you can equip that and you can build things like shelves. You need to be level 2 in carpentry. That can't be right. That can't be right. Really? Oh, okay. Really? Oh well. Really? <laughs> what? That's nuts. I didn't think that that was the case. Uh, right. Instead, what we'll do is we'll uh, we'll dump the axe in there, put the hammer back in our bag, put the saw in there, put the nails in there, equip our bat, and we're just gonna go out and uh, we'll drop that in there as well. We're just gonna go out and loot more then. Um. Because I want... Right, what I'm going to do is... I am going to look for the Carpentry for Beginners book. Oh, let us guess. I bet I've already got it. I just haven't read it. No. I've got Farming for Beginners. Right, I'm going to hit the local houses then. I'm going to hit their bookshelves and I'm going to look for Carpentry for Beginners. No, now, before I started this, uh, this video just now... So after the end of episode 1 and before the episode of episode 2, episode 1.5 if you will, that I didn't record. That doesn't make sense. Um, I uh, killed a zombie. There was a zombie he headbutt in the window and I could hear it in the house. I was like, oh, well, I want to protect me neighbours, you know what I mean? And he dropped a big hiking bag. Now the big hiking bag, the school bag stores 15. It's got a capacity of 15 kilograms. But the big hiking bag stores uh, 22. And you can still put it on your back. So I'm going to grab that. I'm going to unequip that one, and I'm going to equip that one. And equip on your back. Yeah, you can put the hiking bag on your back. I know, it's daft, but you can. Uh, right, and then we can get the school bag, and we can just you know, get the get the bat in our hands. Right, let's, uh, let's secure the house first. Yeah. Let's look secure, nothing hiding around there. No, in here. Nothing. Nothing. Right, okay, so house is secure. Now, um, let's, uh, just going to dump that school bag in there, don't, I don't need it. Right, now, let us take, uh, the garbage bags, because we need those to make rain catches later on. Um, I like to take the bags of chips, because they're good to have in your inventory and just eat, um, in an emergency. I like to keep some in me, uh, in pockets, just so I can, uh, carry them around with us. Um, I don't know what I've got in the way of cooking things, but that doesn't really matter. Um, I'm not going to take any food right now, because that's safe in there. Um, it's, you know, I don't, I don't need to loot food from next door just yet. 
I will take the salt though because the salt is used in making bread dough. Yeah, okay, good. Now, the bookshelves, that's what it came for. Now, for, see, I can mouse over that and see number of pages read one. Obviously, I remember that I read Farm from Beginners uh, because I just checked my own bookshelf. But if you've got a lot of books in there, it's easy to forget which ones you've got. So that's really useful. If you read every book you've got until you, the first page, then you can see, oh, I've already got that. Oh, I haven't got that. I'll pick it up. Saves you having to pick up all the books because they're quite heavy. They're like a kilogram each, I think. So it's definitely... Definitely a good idea. Oh, normal hiking bag. Right, so that's good. That can be that can replace the school bag as my secondary bag, you see? Grab the sheet as well because I can make curtains with it. Right, okay. And then uh alright, so we're good here. I don't need anything out of here just yet. I'm gonna close all these curtains. Just so if I come in here again, I don't have zombies seeing as an attack in the house. Oh. Uh, right. That's another thing. When there's a when there's a when there's a broken window, you can climb through it, but you want to remove the broken glass first, so you can do that. If you remove the broken glass first, then you can climb through it and you'll not get cut. If you don't remove the broken glass, then uh, then you will get cut, and it will hurt, and it will be a shame. So anyway, now I'm going to head across the road um, to the next house. Is there anything in the mailboxes that right now? What the hell was that noise? I re- Oh, I really want the, uh... Alright, calm down. I really want that, uh, that book. Before I do any carpentry, I want to make sure I've got the book, so I'm, I'm, uh, basically super effective in my levelling. Uh, that's why I'm going for the book. Before I do anything with carpentry, before I chop any trees, board up the windows. Boarding up the windows improves your carpentry skill. I think that's what happened last time. Oh, that's good. Um, yeah, that's what happened last time, basically. Uh, I must have gotten to level two quite quickly because I had, I'd had read the book and I basically boarded up all the houses and that leveled me up. So that's all I'm going to do again this time. Um, anyway, also, you can encounter random events like this. Not an event, but like, you know, people who've obviously been, who've died... I mean, he's got a pistol, so I'm going to take it. The pistol's got, doesn't have any enhancements on it, but it's full condition. Damage is 50%. I'm going to take it. It's a good, oh shit, weapon, that one. Oh, this door's locked. Oh, I've not seen a locked door yet. Wow, okay. I've never encountered a locked door. I'm going to turn the TV off. I've never encountered a locked door. Anyway, let's make sure. Shit. God, that's, that's breaking it. I, I must be the only person who actually gets, like, nervous <laughs> in this game. <laughs> that's ridiculous, man. I mean, it's scary, though. When you, it's, it's dark when you walk around the corner and, and you're like, there's zombies there. It's nuts. Anyway, the house is... This house is clear. Uh, right. Cabinet. Right. Want some antidepressants? Get some of that shit on the go. Let's take the sleeping tablets and the sheet. Uh, don't want the, be uh, the bleach. We'll take the cotton balls, though, because you can uh, douse them in alcohol and you can use them to wipe wounds. Sleeping tablets again. Tissue. I don't know if tissue is useful for anything, but I'll leave it. Uh, right, okay. This. What's in here? Duffel bag. 18. What's our on a hiking bag? 20. Okay, we don't need the duffel bag. You only ever really need two bags. You never need a, an extra one. Video game. Don't need that. Pillow, underwear, nothing there. Right, okay. Advanced trapping. I've got it already. Expert trapping. I'll take that. Farming for beginners. Already got it. The farming magazine. Already used. Trapping for beginners, I'll take that. Uh, I'll take the books. I'll take the magazines and I'll take the newspapers as well. They, they alleviate boredom, if you remember me saying last time. Did I go in here? No, I didn't. Take the sheet again. That's all I need. Yeah, bit of there. Right, okay, let's go down. Um, right, okay, so... Might want to bring the axe back. Um... In fact, I'm going to do that now. I'm curious. I want to. I want to go in the garage first. 
Um, can I open the window? Yep. Um, gas can. Yeah, that's good. Okay. A full gas can. That's good. Because it weighs five kilograms, but that's gas for a, um for a, what you call it uh, a generator later on. So that's something. That's something nice. Uh, let's close that window. Right. Um, okay, so I'm going to go... Oh, shit. All right. Yes. All right, yes. right so you, you, you leave a le the length of the baseball bat. About there. Oosh. Oh, that's not quite, but... When you get some practice on it, it can work well. And I think it matters. I think it does. I don't even know. I think it does, though. Let's pretend it does, anyway. Right, so we'll run back and we'll... Oh, hello. I don't need a gardener. Sneak up behind her. Because I'm a burglar. Douche! Smash! Are you buds? Nah, don't, don't need them. Right, okay, anyway. So we'll dump... Actually, we'll dump the... Uh, we'll dump the gas can in here. Right, let's go back out. We'll get the axe and we'll chop that door down. Yeah, so I'll dump all that stuff on the floor and then what I, I'm, I'm gonna build it. I'll have to build a box or something that I can like, like a drop box. Um, so that when I, when I'm, uh, when I'm recording, because no one wants to see me organizing my loot, because everyone, if he's a regular viewer, you know what I'm like. You know what I'm like. So no one wants to see that really. So what I'll do is I'll uh, I'll do that off camera. I'll get everything organised off camera. Right. So anyway, let's break this door down because, like I say, I've not encountered a locked door yet. Everyone's everyone seems to be very un every uh, very trusting in this neighbourhood. Oh, so, oh, it's barricaded. All oh, right. So you can see a little bit of wood sticking out there. So I'll have to uh, uh, equip the hammer. Yeah. There it is. I'll quit the hammer and then I get the plank off. So I'm going to drop that. I thought I'd have to break it down with an axe. It wasn't a locked door. It was a barricaded door. Well, that's different. Right, that's... Uh... Ah, right. Oh, you see? So you can see the story here. The zombies obviously broke in and got in the bathroom. And so he barricaded the door closed. That's cool. But, I mean, where's the zombies? Because the door was locked. But, hey... Let's not worry about that. That was cool. I like that. Oh, I'll leave him. I'll leave him. The baseball bat, yeah, it has uh, it has limited durability. You can see the condition is down to about a third now. So um, you kind of want to be careful. You want to avoid combat, uh, especially in the early days, if if you can, uh, to save your your weapon for when you really need it. You know, because I only got two baseball bats. Yeah, I see is Where are yous? Where are yous? Eh? No? Right. This house is clear. That's all I need out of there. Right, the book. Cooking for intermediates. Well, I'll take that. Master carpentry. Yeah, I'll take that. Trapping for beginners. I think I already have that, but... I'll take it. Grab them. Grab them. Grab that. Maybe this bookshelf will be... Uh, no, nothing here either. It's carpentry for beginners, that's what I want. Carpentry for beginners. I'm taking nothing out of these. Unless there's something specific that I could do with. Timer would be nice. I think you can make timed bombs and stuff. Later on. Nothing else. Mm, bullets. Yeah. Yeah. That's it, I think. Oh, gardening spray can. Yeah, I'll have that. You can, because uh, your you, your plants when you grow them, uh, they get. Why is the two tables stacked on top of each other? That doesn't make any sense. Huh? That's weird. Not seen that before. Bugged. Uh, you, when you're planting plants, they can uh, they can get a bit uh, diseased. So uh, you get a watering. You get a you get a spray like that, and uh, and you you make a, a special recipe. That's what I had to learn when I read that ma got, um, when I read the farming magazine. I uh, I learned the recipe to make those pesticides and shit, you know. 
So that'll come in handy later on down the line. Candle and a lighter? I don't need them. It's the books I want. Farming for beginners. Damn it, man, that's not what I want. Take the expert farm. Farming magazine? Yeah, make flies cure and make mildew cure. That's what you want. Rubber band. Matches. Batteries. Uh, cold pack, I'll take that there. I'm hungry, so I'm, I'm just going to quickly eat something out of this fridge. Where is it? Here. Uh, I'll have an apple. And what else? Some grapes, eh? How about that? Get your fruit. Get your five a day. And a tomato as well. Let's fill me water bottle up at the sink. Oh, okay. Fill the water bottle. If you have a water bottle in your main inventory, uh, you'll drink it naturally. Your character won't get thirsty. Instead, he'll, he'll drink from the water bottle. So that's something worth considering as well. It's really cunning. Anyway, let's move on to the next house. I'm desperate for this carpentry magazine. Ah. Zombie in there. Right, let's shut that door. Just in case anyone's open. Alright, man. Let's check here first. We're good. We don't want to be snuck up upon. Shut that as well. That's it. Down he goes. A rolling pin. You know what? I'm going to tear that actually. Alarm clock and a pistol. Yeah. Has a pistol got anything? No. Sometimes the pistols have attachments on them, like laser sights and, and whatever. Iron sights. Uh, iron sights seems to be an attachment. Um, I don't know why that is, because iron sights obviously are, are naturally just on the gun. So, yeah. Eating a full pineapple makes you super full. Boosh. Well fed. Oh, actually, not super, super full. Uh, right, let's check the bookshelves. Carpentry for beginners. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we want. Shit. Shit, they're coming. They're coming. I don't know where they are. Oh! Oh! The house wasn't that clear. Right, I'll take the nails. Golf club, pool cue. Nah, nothing there. Nails. Nah. Don't need anything from there right now. Cooking for beginners. Yes, I'll take that as well, because that's something I want to gonna wanna read up on. And uh that's it. Don't need anything out of there. Been in there already. I think that's this house done. This house is clear. Finally. Right, let's head back, and I think we'll call that a day. Successful. A success, actually. It's success. Because, basically, we found carpentry for beginners and cooking for beginners. Now, I'm going to read those, and we'll sort out that loot on the floor, and we'll sort out the loot in my bags, and I'm going to sort... Uh, no, I'm not going to sort the loot in the house. I'm going to stop saying that I'm going to... Uh, that I'm going to sort out the loot and organise the chest, because... I'm now going to have to end the video, and uh, and the next time we're going to fortify the house after I've read the book. So I'm going to read the book now, after I finish this episode, I'm going to read the two books, so then I'll get maximum levels from boarding up the house, hopefully I'll get to carpentry level one or two, and then I'll be able to build some shelves and then get some loot organised. Uh, even if I don't, I'm probably going to organise some rudimentary looting system in the house for now, because I don't think I'm going to have enough levels to make the shelves. What I'm going to do is I'm going to empty, uh, I'm going to get the kitchen uh, cabinets, and I'm going to empty them of all the crap. I'm going to empty all the crap out of the house, basically, and keep the stuff I only need, and I'm going to try and get a sorting system going. So anyway, until next time, guys, see you later. Bye-bye.